Well, I can assure you he did not learn that kind of crass behavior from me. You know, maybe I should wait in the hall. Hold on. What is he doing here? Well, my car's in the shop, and Charlie was nice enough to give me a ride. No, Charlie was nice enough to call you a cab, but you wouldn't take it. So what's going on? Your son gave his teacher the bird. Okay, I want it on the record that he didn't necessarily... <laughs> Charlie, just leave it alone. What, what, what exactly happened? Well, I was writing on the board, and he thought I couldn't see him. Is this true? Yeah, I really thought she couldn't see me. <laughs> I'm afraid this kind of behavior is grounds for suspension. Maybe we can catch a matinee. <laughs> Jake, why did you flip Miss Pasternak off? Excuse me. We don't end our sentences with prepositions. We say, why did you flip off Miss Pasternak? <laughs> I think that answers your question. Jake, why did you flip off Miss Pasternak? Because she picks on me? Jake, I don't treat you any differently than any of the other students. Yeah, right. Shut up. <laughs> you know what? I think I'd like to talk to your parents alone now. Come on, Jake. What? I don't even mean to tell my side. Buddy, you're 11. You have no side. <laughs> this isn't my fault. I was provoked. You were provoked? Yeah, it means... I know what it means. <laughs> and it doesn't matter. What you need to do now is apologize. But I'm not sorry. You don't have to be sorry. Just say it. And look it. You've got those big, cute kid eyes. <laughs> Use them. But that would be lying. That's your line in the sand, you mutton head. You just flipped off your teacher. Yeah, but I was being honest. And look where it got you. Oh. I think I just lost my innocence. He's really a very well-behaved boy, but he has had some problems dealing with our separation. That's true, uh, although it wasn't so much a, a separation as a, uh, a kicking out. <laughs> I sympathize, but if I gave special consideration to every child whose parents were going through a divorce, I'd be getting the finger all day. We're, we're not saying that he shouldn't be punished. Oh, he certainly should. But, but just let us try to handle it. By us, he means me. I always have to be the bad guy. Well, you're better at it than me. <laughs> um, than I? <laughs> you are such an ass. Uh, can we have a moment, please? I think that'd be a good idea. And it's... May we have a moment, please? Stop it! Miss Pasternak. I'm sorry, we haven't officially met. I'm Jake's uncle, Charlie. Hello. And I am really sorry. This may not be my place, and if it's not, I am really sorry. But Jake has something he wants to say. I am really sorry. <laughs> Why are you sorry? Well, the kid may have gotten the rude gesture from me. I'm not used to being around children, and, well, I am really sorry. <laughs> well, thank you. I appreciate it, but it doesn't change what Jake did. You're right. You're absolutely right. Jake, go to the vending machine and get Miss uh, Pastor Nack a peach snapple and a bag of Skittles. It is Miss Pasternak, right? <laughs>